So hello there, the name is Prince Truman Imepi, and I warmly welcome you back to my channel. So now this particular video um, has been grouped into playlists, and then this particular playlist is called um, Know The Tricks. So now this playlist is actually here to help you um, figure out some little little tricks that you have to know about Photoshop. So in this particular video here, I'm going to teach you how to create a custom shape in Photoshop. So um, let's just assume anytime you want to um, you design something and then you need this particular icon here you always have to go and go and download you always have to go and then go and download it let me just walk you through how you can get this as a custom shape and then you can be using it yourself so the very first thing i'd like to do here is to make sure you get your uh, whatever that you want to trace whatever um, shape that you want to trace you have to get it on your canvas onto your canvas and then you come to select and then let's choose color range so now with the color range, what we are going to do is to choose the black and then we are going to hit enter or OK. Now when you are done, you realize that we have something here that we call path. Now the path, assuming you don't have it here showing, what you can do is to go to window and then you go to um, path here and then it's going to show. So that when it shows, you see this little icon here, it says that um, make work path from selection. So we click on it and then it's going to make a path selection for us. Now, when it's done, all you have to do is to move to edit and then you come to define custom shape. So what I'm going to name this is I'm going to name this B and then I'm just going to hit OK. So now when you are done, um, let's just say we can delete this. We can delete this. And then anytime we need to draw that particular shape, all what we have to do is to select a shape and then come to custom shape to um, let's see, we scroll down and then we pick it from here. So if I draw it this way, this is it. So the only thing I need to do is to add color to it. You can keep on changing the colors and then you'll be good to go. Yeah. So basically that is it. Um, that is how you created the custom shape. You can just try it on any shape at all and then it's going to work. Thank you for clicking on this video. My name is Prince Chum and I'm ready to see you in the next video. Bye.